<laughs> Hello, beautiful family. So, an interesting question came up the other day, and it was about um, uni ex ones and self pleasure. And I guess there's so much taboo around self pleasure, like you know, it's um, it's like something that you don't talk about, or like, you know, growing up, like um. It was kind of like a no-no, like it, it was just a very great area in some cultures, I guess. And yeah, and now I, I think it's such a self-honoring. It's um, honoring what you're feeling, and of course you can transfer that energy up and above. And sometimes it's just nice for some self-loving. And so the question was regarding guilt that she self pleasures and whether her partner should know about the yoni eggs and ones i personally can't stop talking about yoni eggs because <laughs> they're so healing and amazing so i have spoken to a lot of um people about it because there's so many healing properties and the response from the men have been incredible and some men actually um knew about it and i was like oh wow cool like <laughs> so um <laughs> i feel if the partner is not comfortable with it then um is it because of jealousy or it's just i've got such a res positive response from men it doesn't feel like there would be a negative one but you know in that case next <laughs> so um, <laughs> I just feel like well men do it too. like he would do it too so why aren't you allowed to and yes there are tools healing tools but um, if your woman's happy wouldn't you encourage that and so another thing is a lot of men are like, oh my god, I wish I had a yoni. <laughs> and so for that, um, another thing is what you can do is um, place, well, first of all, the um, smallest yoni egg size would be uh, the best to use for this exercise. Um, or depending on your the size of your vagina um, or yoni, sorry. So, um, yeah, so basically he can insert it or you can insert it or she can, depending on your relationship, partnership, etc. And, um, yeah, and then the man can actually enter that space and also feel the effects of the yoni egg. So that is one way um, of having, um, feeling the yoni egg as well and like the... I think it's a healing from both sides and yeah, uni eggs are quite intense and depending on which crystal you're using, maybe both of you can decide on which one you want to use if you want to create more love in the relationship than rose quartz or lepidolite is also beautiful. So yeah, uh, figuring out the purpose and then going from there. So much love, bye! <laughs>